Hello, good evening. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you tonight? Hi, thanks. Okay. I'm happy you are fine. ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo va el partido? Viendo. <risa> vamos perdiendo. Ya vamos perdiendo. ¿Cuánto? 1 a 0. 1 a 0. Todavía podemos recuperarnos. Hay esperanza. Bueno, van a disculpar que no encienda la cámara, pero como pudieron ver, ¿verdad? Está oscuro acá. Se fue la luz. Desafortunadamente, no, no hay energía acá. Pues estoy con la carga de la laptop, ¿verdad? Y con el internet del celular. Se fue la luz. Entonces, esa es, la razón, esa es la razón por la que no tengo encendida mi cámara. Les pido una disculpa por el inconveniente. Así que... Good evening, everybody. Hello, Jaime. Good evening. Así que no puedo ni escuchar el partido. No, no hay luz. Ahí me avisan cuando le caigan los goles a la selecta. <risa> Qué mal. <risa> ok, so, yes, in yesterday class we were uh, studying. Good Hello, good evening, welcome to the class. Uh, do we have any question about the exercises on the platform? ¿Tiene alguna pregunta acerca de los ejercicios en la plataforma? Ya estamos trabajando en la sección 4 y 5. ¿Yes? Yes, yes teacher. Yes, ok. Um, ¿Alguien ya terminó la sección 5 y solo le falta el examen final? Yo ya lo terminé. Yes, teacher. Yes, ok. Eh, Yo terminé todo. Okay, perfect. Congratulations then. Very good job. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Ya pueden ver su diploma. No. Hasta ayer no, no estaba todavía. Ahora no he revisado. Ah, okay. Excellent. I'm going to ask that. Uh, okay. I'm going to investigate what is happening with the diploma. Am I going to... Hello, Jonathan, good evening, and I'm going to tell you tomorrow. So if you don't have any question, si no tiene ninguna pregunta, let's start with tonight class. Hey. Okay, today we are going to have this topic, eating for a good luck. Comiendo para la buena suerte. Let's see. ¿Ustedes tienen alguna tradición en Navidad con los alimentos? Bread and chicken. Oh, bread and chicken for Christmas. Eh, ¿Han escuchado eso de que hay que comerse 12, 12 uvas a las 12 de la noche? Yeah. Ok. ¿Alguna vez lo han practicado? ¿Lo han hecho? Sí, no, right. So, eating for good look. Bueno, veamos, hay un micrófono que está haciendo interferencia. Ok, thank you. So, let's go. Eating for good look. But before to go to tonight's topic, we're going to have this review. So let's see, we're going to take turns to answer the following questions. Let's see the following question. The first one, what is your favorite food? What is the answer for that question? What is your favorite food? My favorite food is Mexican food. Excellent, any other answer? Any other answer? My favorite food is Mexican. Mexican food, excellent. Any other Mexican answer? Mexican food. Any other answer? What is your favorite food? That is the question. 
my family food is fish and seafood. Seafood, my favorite food is seafood. Excellent. Any other question? My, my favorite, favorite food is Chinese. Chinese food, delicious. Food. My favorite food is pasta. My favorite food is pasta. Thank you. Then let's see the other question. Get ready to answer the following question. Do you like milk? That is a yes, no question. So you have two options to answer this. Do you like milk? Yes. Yes, I yes, do. I do. Oh. Yes, I do. And the other answer is, no, I don't. ¿A quién no le gusta la leche? And you say, no, I don't. Me. Okay. So, do you like milk? You say, no, I don't. No, I don't. Hello, Mario Valdez. I understand. Just be careful, please. Let's see, do you like seafood? I like it. Yes, okay. I do. Yes, I do. Yes, I like it. That is a good answer too. Any other answer? Do you like seafood? Let me choose someone. Uh, let's see who is connected tonight. Uh, let's see. Jaime, do you like seafood? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Johnny, do you like seafood? Yes, I do. Carla de Hernandez, do you like seafood? Yes, I do. And let's see, Maria Sanchez, do you like seafood? Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Elizabeth Velasquez, do you like seafood? Yes, I do. Marvin Romero, do you like seafood? Then let's see the next question. Things yes, no, yes, I do. Let's see, do you like onions? That is the other question. Do you like onions? No, I don't. Thank you. Any other answer? Yes, I do. Okay, thank you. Let's see the next question in this part. Let me see. How often do you eat fish? How often do you eat fish? Mm. I, I sometimes eat fish. Thank you, I sometimes eat fish. Let's see, Johnny Guevara, how often do you eat fish? Uh, I sometimes eat fish. eat fish. Thank you, fish. Jonathan. Jonathan Serpas, how often do you eat fish? ¿Con qué frecuencia come pescado? And you say, I never, I always, I usually. I never eat, eat fish. fish. Excellent. Jose Antonio, how often do you eat fish? I sometimes eat fish. I sometimes eat fish. Excellent. Next question. Do you like fruit? Maria Cruz, do you like fruit? Yes, I do. Thank you, Carla de Hernandez. Do you like food? Fruit, sorry. Yes, I do. Francisco Fernandez, do you like fruit? Good evening. Hello, good evening. So, Angela Rosario, do you like fruit? I, I like fruit. 
Okay, excellent. Yes, I like fruit. Let's see the next question is, do you like coffee? Do you like coffee? No, I don't. Yes, I like it. Okay, no, I don't. Yes, I like it. Or you can say, I really like coffee. I love coffee. Okay, let's see the next one. Let's see the next one, please. And the other question is, Yeah. Bueno, um, no se vayan a molestar si les desactivo el micrófono, ¿verdad? porque algunos hay bastante ruido. I know that you are enjoying the soccer match. Okay, your friends, your family. So the next question is, do you like baseballs? Do you like baseballs? I like baseball. Yes, I like baseball. Yes, I do. It's a good answer too. Yes, I like baseball. Excellent. Thank you. Next question. What is your favorite baseball? My the favorite my... baseball is tomato. Tomatoes. Okay. My favorite baseball is um, potatoes. Potatoes. My favorite, my favorite base, baseball uh, is um, zucchini. Zucchini, excellent. That my is, favorite uh, vegetable is carrot. Carrot, perfect. My favorite baseball is carrot. So what is your favorite fruit? And this is the last question in this part. What is your favorite fruit? My favorite fruit is coconut. <laughs> Coconut, okay. My favorite fruit is an apple. Apples are delicious. Red or green apples? Uh, green. Green apples. Green apple. My favorite fruit is um, strawberry. Can you please repeat? My favorite fruit is? Strawberry. Strawberry. Ah, strawberries, strawberries, las fresas, strawberries. Excellent. Do you like chicken? I have another one here. Do you like chicken? Yes, I like. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Okay. Hay alguien en el grupo que no le gusta el pollo? Nobody. No, I don't. Oh, William say no, I don't. Uh, how often do you drink tea? ¿Con qué frecuencia toma té? Cuando estoy enojado, teacher, para que me bajen los nervios. How often do you drink tea? All night. Hardly Never. ever. Hardly ever. Always or every night. I always drink tea. I every always, night. I always drink tea. I drink I tea. Every night. Ah, aquí la tengo. Ok. Con pruebas lo digo. Ok. Excellent. Let's see. And now we're going to use some or any to answer this question. Let's see the face. Pay attention to the little face you are going to see in every question. Do you need any oil? So la carita triste significa que no necesita. ¿Cómo sería esa respuesta? Do you need any oil? No, I don't. Ah, okay, you say, no, I don't need any oil. No, I don't need any oil. Let's see the next. No, I don't need any oil. Excellent. Let's see, do you want any eggs? No, I don't want any eggs. Excellent answer. Do you have any oranges? Do you have any oranges? And yes. Have a... Yes, I have any. Yes, oranges. I need some eggs. 
Yes, I have some orange. Yes, that's the correct answer. Yes, I have some oranges. Let's see the next one. Do you need any pupusas? Yes. Yes, I need some pupusas. Yes, I need some pupusas. Okay, what is your favorite pupusas ingredient? What is your favorite pupusas flavor? Cheese and Cheese. and lorocos? Yes. Okay. Let's go to the next question. Do you need any salt? Yes, I need some salt. Some salt. Yes, excellent queen. Excellent answer. Do you need any sugar? No, I don't need I don't. any sugar. Excellent. No, I don't need any sugar. Would you like some chocolate? Would you like no, some chocolate? I don't, yeah, I don't like any chocolate. Okay, in this case, you say yes, please. Sí, por favor. Yes, please. Oh, no, thank you. Would you like some chocolate? Yes, please. Very much. Yes, please. Okay, yes, please. Oh, no, thank you. Let's see the other question. Do you have any mayonnaise? Mayonnaise. Do you have any mayonnaise? Yes, I have some mayonnaise. Excellent. Do you need any flour? No, I don't I need don't any flour. Excellent. Would you like some cake? No, I don't like any cake. Okay. No, I don't like any cake or not. Thank you. In this cake. Okay, now let's see. I'm going to... Tonight, we're going to learn these two words, quite and really. You can add quite or really to like. Podemos agregar estas dos palabras antes del verbo like. Bueno, quite significa un poco, que le gusta un poco. Really significa que le gusta mucho. So look at this. I quite like Spanish food. I like it, but it isn't my favorite. Pueden apagar su micrófono. Can you please turn off your microphone, please? Thank you very much. So, as I said before, tonight we are going to learn these two words, quite and really. You can add quite or really to like. Podemos agregar estas dos palabras, quite or really, al verbo like. I quite like Spanish food. So let's see, esto significa me gusta un poco. Me gusta un poco la comida española. I like it, me gusta, but it's in my favorite, pero no es mi favorita. Cuando usted utiliza really, I really like Spanish food. I really like Spanish food. So it means I like it a lot. Significa que le gusta muchísimo. También para hablar acerca de lo que nos gusta y no nos gusta, podemos utilizar love and hate. Podemos utilizar estos otros dos verbos. Love, me gusta muchísimo. I love apples. I love pasta. And hate es lo contrario. Yo odio. I hate boiled eggs. No me gustan los huevos tibios. I hate roasted chicken. No me gusta el pollo rostizado. So we can use quite para decir que un alimento nos gusta un poco nada más. And really para decir que nos gusta muchísimo. Otras dos opciones son el verbo love and hate. I love apples. I love pasta. I hate boiled eggs. I hate roasted chicken. So let me see fish. Let's see. 
William Villalta, what about fish? You say, I quite like fish or I really like fish? I really like fish. Ah, okay, eso significa que le gusta muchísimo. Mucho, sí. Okay, let's see, kiwis, Mario Valdez, the fruit kiwi. I quite like kiwi or I really like kiwis? I really like kiwi. Excellent. René Merlos, meat, carne. I quite like meat or I really like meat? René, hello. Hello. Quiet is different than quiet. I quite, I quite like. I quite like. Quite means tranquilo, right? En este caso significa un poco. En este contexto. Oh, estoy confundido porque a veces, bueno, podemos decir be quiet es como guardar silencio o callarse. Ok, pero en este contexto significaría un poco. Bueno. Quiet is, is, is a different word. So quiet is se deletrea de otra manera. I quite like. Quiet is another one. It's another word. So in this case, I quite like. Okay. The different. Yes, it's different. Yeah, and and in real in reality. No tiene nada que ver con de verdad. No, it means realmente. Realmente me gusta, de verdad me gusta. Really. Any other question? No question. When this is quiet, y la otra palabra es quiet. Se deletrea Q, U, I. Ever, that is quiet, be quiet. In this case, it's quiet. It's another one. It's otra palabra, quiet. So I quite like, me gusta un poco. That is the meaning. Mm, any other question? Is it clear? Is it clear, guys? Let me know, please. Yes, I clear. It's different. Yes, word. it is. It is a different word. Thank you, Mario. Exactly. Okay, then let's go with the next two verbs: love and hate. Pueden decirme una, un alimento que les guste mucho. You say, "I love chicken. I love fish. I love lasagna." Excellent. Thank you. I love lasagna. I love raw beef. I love coffee. Okay, excellent. Roast beef. Oh, roast beef. Roast, roasted beef. Yes, roast beef. Okay, thank you. Eh, algún alimento que odie, así que no se lo coma. No me lo coma aunque me lo regalen, dice usted. I hate. Sí, el cilantro, ¿cómo se dice? <laughs> I hate celery. Celery. I hate celery. celery. I hate celery. I hate hígado de res. Okay. Liver. Okay. Okay. El cilantro es lo mismo que el apio. No, no, son diferentes. No, no. Ah, okay. Sure. Diferentes. Ah, okay. I am confused then. Okay. Cilantro. 
I love cilantro. Pantalla en inglés, ¿cómo se dice? Y para teacher, like para cilantro. Okay. Yo voy a los dos para no poner los, los no no escribir los nombres está para decir los dos los voy a los dos. Okay. Por ejemplo, then, el cilantro con el apio. Ah, then you say I hate. I hate cilantro and apio. Cilantro se escribe lo mismo, right? It's the same, cilantro. And apio is celery. Then you have to say, I hate celery and cilantro. No me gusta el apio ni el cilantro. I hate. Y espinaca, ¿cómo dice spinach? Spinach. Spinaca. Spinach. I hate spinach. Okay. I hate spinach. Okay, excellent. Then let's continue. Um, again, hay un micrófono que está haciendo interferencia. Thank you. So, eating food for good looking. Eating food for good look. Eating for good look. This is the topic for today. This is a reading. This is the reading part. On New Year's Day, many people eat special food for good look in the new year. Ya casi viene, ¿verdad? El final del año. Y hay algunas tradiciones. ¿verdad? In different countries, they have different traditions. And look at this, for example. Some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are round, round food in and begin again, like years. Do you have any question, any new vocabulary in this small paragraph? Some Chinese people eat tangerines. Tangerines are tangerines. round. What is tangerines? Tangerines, mandarinas. mandarinas. Thank you. Are round. Las mandarinas son That's redondas, right. son redondas. Round food and, and begin again. La, la, los alimentos que son redondos terminan y comienzan otra vez. O sea, no tienen fin. Like years, como los años. So let's see the next one. It is a Jewish custom to eat apples with honey for sweet. For sweet new year. It is a Jewish custom to eat apples with honey for a sweet new year. New vocabulary. Can you please repeat? What is a Jewish? Jewish is judío. Custom oh. is custom is tradition. Es una tradición judía to eat apples with honey for a sweet new year. Really? Okay, apples and honey. Apples, miel, miel con manzanas. ¿Alguna vez no han probado? No, delicious. Yeah, okay, is it delicious? Pancake. <laughs> honey with pancakes. Let's see, greet it's basilopita, bread with a coin inside. Everyone tries to find the coin for luck and money in the new year. In Grecia, ¿verdad? Se comen este pan. Look at the picture. Llamado basilopita. Con una moneda dentro. Everyone tries to find the coin for luck and money in the new year. Todos intentan ¿verdad? encontrar la moneda y el que la encuentra tiene buena suerte y dinero en el próximo, en el siguiente año, in the new year, en el año nuevo. So, these are some traditions, Chinese, Jewish, and Greeks. China, los judíos y los griegos. Teacher. Yes. The 12 great. Oh, that is in the other part. Let's go with the next. Look at this. In Spain and some Latin American countries, people eat 12 grades at midnight on New Year's Eve. 
one grade for a good look in each month of the new year. So in España, in algunos países de America Latina, people eat 12 grades at midnight on New Year's Eve. El 31 de diciembre, a las 12 en punto, son 12 uvas. One grade for good luck in each month of the new year. Una uva por cada mes, para tener suerte en cada uno de los 12 meses del año. ¿Alguna vez han intentado esta tradición? Yes, I oh, Yes, I tried. Ah, ok. Bueno, por como vienen los años, mejor que sean 24, ¿verdad? Para que haya doble suerte cada mes, 24 uvas. Exactly. <laughs> Then let's see, on New Year's Day in Japan, people eat moki, rice cakes for strength in the new year. En el año nuevo, pastel los japoneses, de arroz. ok, moki, rice cakes, pasteles de arroz for strength in rice the cakes. new year. Para tener fuerza, ¿verdad? En el próximo año, strength in the new year. Some American from Southern stay eat black eye peas. Some American from Southern states, para los estados del sur, ¿verdad? En Estados Unidos, eat black eye peas and rice with color greens. With color greens, the black eye peas are like coins and the greens are like dollars. New vocabulary in this. What is black eye peas? Uh, vocabulario nuevo en ese último párrafo. What is black eye peas? Oh, black eye peas son guisantes de color negro. En rice. Okay. En colar, colar green es una planta, ¿verdad? De, con hojas de color verde, es una planta. Y entonces los, los guisantes, ¿verdad? Representan a las monedas y las hojas verdes de esa planta, que son colar greens, eh, son los dólares. Entonces se comen este platillo para tener dinero en el siguiente año. So it's very interesting. So let's see, I have this question for you. Some people eat tangerines. In qué país? In which country? China. China. Okay, some Chinese people eat tangerines. Some Jewish people eat with the honey from the sweet deer. ¿Qué alimento combinan con la miel? Apple. Apple. Oh. Apples, excellent. Apple. Some Jewish people eat apples with honey for a sweet beer. Uh, eat basilopita bread mm. with a coin mm. inside. Greek. Can you please repeat? Greece. Oh, Greeks, Greeks. Eat basilopita bread with a coin inside. Oh, sorry. In Spain, people eat great for a good look in the new year. ¿Cuántas uvas son? 24. <laughs> 24. <laughs> este año tienen que ser 24 or more. But 12, 12. It says 12 in the reading. The Japanese eat rice for... What's the reason the Japanese people eat rice? Well, moshi. Oh, yes, the name of the dish is mochi. Okay. Pero, ¿cuál okay. es la razón? ¿Por qué se comen eso? For, for strength. Okay, for strength. For strength in the new year. Strength. The black strength. Strength. is... Tradición. Let's see the next one. The black eye peas are like coins and the color green are like dollars. Dollars. Okay. 
those and the correct answer. So a volunteer, please to read a first and second sentence. Who wants to participate? A volunteer, please. Some Some Chinese. Chinese. Is dangerous. Excuse me. <laughs> okay, give me a second. Some Jewish people eat apple white honey for a sweet year. Thank you. The next one, number three and number four. Any other volunteer? Three and four, please. Bricks eat basilopita, bread with a coin in Spain. In Spain, people eat 12 grapes. For good. In Spain, people eat 12 great for good look in the New Year. Thank you. Five and six, who wants to read them? The Japanese hit rice for strength in the New Year. And the last one, please. Me, Mario. The black eyed peas are like coin and the green are like dollar. Thank you, Mario. Excellent job. So let's see, conversation practice, talking about food. In, in this practice, we're going to have this question. What's your favorite food? What's your favorite fast food? What's your favorite drink? What's your favorite kind of meat? What's your favorite kind of egg meat food? What's your favorite snack? Do you like trying new food? Let's see the first one. Who wants to read the first one? Oh, sorry. Who wants to answer the first question? ¿Quién quiere contestar la primera pregunta? A volunteer, me, please. Me, Mario. Thank you, Mario. My favorite, my favorite food is uh, pupusas. Thank you. My favorite food are pupusas. Thank you. Next question. What's your favorite fast food? A volunteer to answer this question. Fast mm -hmm. food or junk food? Thank you. What's the answer? My favorite fast food is pizza. Thanks a lot. The next one. What's your favorite drink? A volunteer to answer this question, please. What's your favorite drink? ¿Cuál es su bebida favorita? My favorite drink is water. Thank you. My favorite drink is water. Nice. She is so healthy. Number four, what's your favorite kind of meat? It means do you prefer beef, carne de res, pork, carne de cerdo, rabbit, Fish. My favorite kind of meat is fish. Okay. Uh, what's your favorite kind of ethnic food or typical food? I volunteer to answer this. My favorite kind of ethnic food is Pupusas. Thank you. Enchiladas. What? Enchiladas too. What's your favorite yuca snack? Yuca frita. <laughs> okay, excellent. Try yuca. What's your favorite snack? Su bocadillo favorito. Brown chip. My favorite snack on salty snack. My favorite snack is corn chips. Corn chips, okay. Oh, when are the maize? Corn chips, corn chips. Oh, corn. Corn chips. And do you like trying your food? 
¿Les gusta probar comida nueva? Chinese food, Thai food, Mexican food, Italian food. Yes, I do. Yes, I like. Okay, excellent. Let's see another set. Japanese food. Japanese food too. Ah, okay. Japanese Boyo food. Walk. Ah, that is uh, from the China word, Chinese food. How often do you drink coffee? Mm -hmm. Every day. I always coffee. Oh, and then you say, I always drink coffee. I sometimes drink coffee. I never drink coffee. How often do you drink soda? I sometimes drink soda. Then you say, I sometimes drink soda. I never mm -hmm. drink soda. I hardly ever drink soda. I hardly ever drink soda. Number three. Drink do you, water, much better. Do you usually drink coffee in the morning? Yes, always. Next one, do you eat cereal in the morning? I sometimes. Sometimes. What time do you usually have lunch? ¿A qué horas usualmente almuerzan? At noon. At noon. At noon. What time do you usually have dinner? At 7 p.m. At 7 p.m. What do you usually have for dinner? I always have for dinner. Okay, let this last question one. Thank you. What do you usually have for dinner? I usually have for dinner. Do you stay in list of los alimentos que usualmente viene para la cena? I usually have for dinner uh, eggs and uh, potato and bread. Potato. Okay. Potatoes. Okay, excellent answer. Thank you. Let's discuss question number one. How often do you drink coffee? Acá vamos a utilizar a frequency adverbs. Una breve de frecuencia para responder. And you say, I always drink coffee. I never drink coffee, or I usually, sometimes, hardly ever, seldom, etc. How often do you drink soda? El mismo caso, utilizamos un adverbio de frecuencia. I rarely drink soda. I normally drink soda. I usually drink soda. Do you, do you usually drink coffee in the morning? This is a yes, no question. So you say, yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you usually drink coffee in the morning? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you eat cereal in the morning? Is another yes, no question. So you say, yes, I do. No, I don't. The next one is an information question. Acá nos pregunta a qué horas. What time do you usually have lunch? A qué horas That is a WH word question, an information question. Y nos pregunta por una hora específica. What time do you usually have lunch? Y usted dice, I have lunch at. I usually have lunch at one o'clock, two o'clock, 12 o'clock. What do you usually have for lunch? It's another information question. What do you usually have for lunch? ¿Qué usualmente almuerzan? Y usted dice, I usually have chicken, rice, and salad. I usually have meat, rice, and salad. In El Salvador, almost every dish is with rice and salad. Casi todos los platillos ¿verdad? que venden para el almuerzo va acompañado de ensalada y arroz. So, what time do you usually have dinner? Una vez más, information question. ¿A qué horas cena? 
¿A qué horas usualmente usted cena? And you say, I usually have dinner at 7 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 5 o'clock, 8 o'clock, 10 o'clock, 12 o'clock. So, what do you usually have for dinner? ¿Qué alimentos usualmente tiene para cenar? And you say, I usually have for dinner uh, pizza, pupusas, hamburgers, beans, eggs, cream, etc. So, that is the way we are going to answer these questions. Do you have any questions? No. No question. Then let's practice. Vamos a escoger de acá algunas preguntas. ¿Cuáles gustaría discutir con sus compañeros? What's your favorite drink? Ok, excelente. Anotémosla todos porque vamos a trabajar en pequeños grupos y vamos a practicar. What's your favorite drink? Es la primera que vamos a discutir con sus compañeros. What's your favorite drink? What's your favorite drink? Muy bien. ¿Cuál otra de este set de preguntas les gustaría discutir con sus compañeros? Number six. What's your favorite snack? Ok. What's your favorite snack? What's your favorite snack? Una más de este grupo. What's your favorite snack? It's number seven. Number seven, do you like trying new food? Okay, excellent, number seven. Do you like trying new food? Excellent. Esa es una yes, no question, right? La respuesta sería yes, I do, or no, I don't. Vamos al siguiente set de preguntas. Vamos a escoger dos de acá. Which one do you want to discuss with your classmate? Let me know. Uh, I'm sorry. Ya habían copiado de las del set anterior. Perdón, no les pregunté. Yes. 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 yes? Okay. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for that. So tell me, which one? We are going to choose two questions to discuss with your classmate. Um, letter seven. Letter, oh, number seven. What time do you usually have dinner? Thank you. What time do you usually have dinner? Which other one? Escojamos una más. The last one, please. How often do you drink coffee? Okay, excellent. How often do you drink coffee? That is a good one. Thank you. How often do you drink coffee? Ok, uh, todos copiaron las preguntas. Are you ready? Let me know, please, when you are ready. Are you ready? ¿Cuáles son las otras dos aparte de la primera? This one is how often do you drink coffee in number seven. Number one and number seven. What time do you usually have dinner? Okay. And, okay. And you are going to say, I usually have dinner at. Y usted dice la hora, a qué horas tiene la cena. Bueno, vamos a dividirlos en grupos pequeños. Teacher, any question? What is your question? Uh, how, how do you say jugo de naranja? Orange juice. 
orange juice. Thank you. Thank you for your question. So let's see, we are 20. Ok, here we go. Por favor, cuando reciban la invitación, ¿verdad? Agréguense a las pequeñas salas para que puedan compartir su, con sus compañeros. Practice, please, with your classmates. And I'm going to visit some of you. Voy a visitar algunos de ustedes. So, here we go. Are you ready? ¿Están listos? Yes. Yes. Ok. Elizabeth recibió la invitación para unirse a los grupos. Este, ¿Cuál, es, ¿Cuál es tu? ¿Cuál es su bebida favorita? ¿Cuál es su? Su bebida favorita. Aquí incluye el, perdón, soda le vamos a poner. Ajá, y te enteré en contestar my favorite drink. Sí, verdad, my favorite. Ajá, y ahí dices tú que es. Es malo, pero es favorito. <laughs> my favorite food my favorite food so uh, I would like to say my favorite drink is my email favorite, say, okay. my favorite free my favorite food my favorite my favorite drink drinks uh -huh, is que lo que más le gusta tomar <laughs> Soda o coffee. Ay, jugo, ¿cómo le ponemos jugo? Sería. Solo jugo es como juiz, pero juiz. por eso, ah, por eso lo preguntó el compañero, jugo de naranja. Le dijo uh -huh. orange, orange juiz. Uh, vaya, entonces tendría que ser, si no es soda, es este. My favorite. Is my favorite fruit is who? No, drink. 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 And drink. Uh -huh. My favorite drink is quiz. My favorite, my favorite drink mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. is drink. Right. Oh, y la or drink sería... soda, right? Uh -huh. Oh, so. Mm -hmm. La segunda is what's 
What's your favorite snack? What? What is your favorite? Mocadillo. Para usted cuál es? Para usted cuál es? Chocolate. Chocolate. Entonces le ponemos my. Ajá, y es como lo que a usted le gusta, puede ser chocolate. Chocolate. Ajá, pero solo vaya contestándolas así, como lo que usted crea. Sí, lo que Ajá, vaya, vamos con la otra. Do you like trying new food? Yes. Esa es una, ajá, una pregunta. Ajá. Yes, I do food. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, yes, I do. Yes. O oh, no, hay. Vaya, la otra es... What time do you usually have dinner? What's dinner? Son como boquitas, por ejemplo. Son como boquitas. Correcto. Ajá. Hello, do you have any question? No question, teacher. No question, teacher. Oh, no question. Oh, bien, sí, sí, teacher. Sí, teacher, tenemos una pregunta. Por ejemplo, snack se refiere a, a boquitas. Oh, yes, snacks, some bocadillos. It could be chocolate, cookies, cake. Eh, salty apple, snack, porque hay una salty snack. Apple, ice cream, candy, pizza, eh, muffin, or chips. Esos pueden ser los snacks, los bocadillos, que se comen entre comidas, como un chocolate, chocolate, sí, sí. una galleta, cookies. Un cupcake, un cakeito, un cakeito, ice cream, candy. Okay. Those are snacks. So let's see, what about the first question? What is your favorite drink? Jonathan, what's your favorite drink? Excuse me? What's your favorite drink? Oh, my favorite drink is coffee. Coffee, okay, excellent answer. Byron Andrade, what's your favorite drink? Byron está, no podía contestar, no dijo. Ah, okay, uh, excellent. Then Jaime, uh -huh. what's your favorite drink? My favorite drink is orange juice. Orange juice, my bien. Let's see the orange. next question. Uh, what's your favorite snack? My favorite snack is chocolate. Chocolate, okay, I mean, your case is Jonathan, sorry. My favorite snack is chocolate soup. Chocolate, okay, excellent. Uh, how often do you drink coffee? Well, I want to know, how often do you drink coffee? Con que frecuencia I, I, al I always drink coffee. Okay, thank you, Jonathan. In your case, Jaime, how often do you drink coffee? I, I, some, I sometimes drink coffee. Thanks a lot. Bueno, eh, sigan discutiendo. Todavía nos quedan dos minutos de la práctica. Sigan discutiendo las otras preguntas. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Okay, gracias. Thank you. Thank you. <coughs>
tortillas. What time do you usually have dinner? Um, I usually have dinner or seven or six or, or eight p.m. What do you usually have for dinner? I usually have for dinner uh, eggs and potato or uh, uh, rice or only. Yes. Continue. I ask for you. How often do you drink coffee? Tema no es para discutirlo, ese tema. Hey, ya, ya vino. Hi, teacher. Teacher. Hello, do you have any question? Perdimos, teacher. Perdí, ajá, perdimos oh, okay. también uh, parte de eso. What is the final score? Uh, two a uh, zero. Okay, Mexico two, El Salvador zero. Okay. Eh, como siempre. Okay, that may be sad. Eso me pone triste. <laughs> ¿Qué tal? ¿Cómo se sienten no, no, ustedes? No, no sé, teacher. Yo a usted lo escucho mexicano, fíjese. No, oh, mm. I'm Salvadorian. I'm Salvadorian. Salvad <risa> Salvadorian. Ok. Ok. Eh, ¿Cómo se sienten ustedes después del partido? ¿Se pudo hacer más? Ah, sí, pues sí. <risa> <risa> no, los técnicos nos van a llamar ya. <laughs> okay, what about the equation? Terminaron de practicar? Eh, Algunas que otras. Okay. Okay. Let's see, for example, what's your favorite drink? What's your favorite drink? <laughs> My favorite uh, drink is me. Up here. <laughs> uh, can you please repeat? My favorite drink is. Uh, Jose Antonio, what's your favorite drink? Uh, uh, my favorite drink is uh, um, tea. It's tea, okay. Teodoro, what's your favorite drink? My favorite drink is a lemonade. Lemonade, okay. lemonade. Okay, lemonade. Okay, and the other question, what, how often do you drink coffee? How often do you drink coffee? ¿Con qué frecuencia toma café? I sometimes uh, drink coffee all day. Ok. I, oh, I sometimes drink coffee during the day. ¿En Teodoro? I sometimes one time of the day. Ok. I sometimes drink coffee. Excellent. Los veo en un minuto en la reunión con todos. Gracias. Excellent job. Thank you. Hey, okay. Okay, thank you, teacher. William, ¿terminó la práctica con sus compañeros? Hey, hello, Teodoro, welcome to the class. Hello, José Antonio, Jamilet, María Cruz, welcome again. Hello, hello, hello. hello. Sí, teacher, sí lo terminamos. Ah, ok. Hi, teacher. Hello, how was your practice? Hello. Solo que yo creo que quizás el compañero se salió porque a mí también se me quedó un rato que no podíamos accesar a nada. Ah, uh, okay. I'm sorry to hear that. It is raining, right? 
Is it raining in the place you live? ¿Está lloviendo donde viven ustedes? Sí, aquí está lloviendo súper recio. Ah, uh, probably that is the reason. Eh, it is raining here too. Está lloviendo acá también. No regresó la luz, ¿verdad? ¿no? Tal vez hasta mañana, probably. Okay, do you have any question about your practice? Do you have any question? No. No One question. question, teacher. Tell me, Mario, what is your question? Um, how do you say plátano fritos? We say fry banana. Fry banana. Okay, excellent. Thank you. How, how, how do you say refresco de, de coco? Uh, coconut refresh. Coconut refresh, refresco de coco. Coconut refresh. Oh, you can say coconut water. Coconut water uh, with the cocoa. Okay, any other question? Si no hay más preguntas, thank you. Thank you for your punctuality. Thank you for your attention. Thank you for your participation. Eh, me comentaron en uno de los grupos que perdió la selecta. I'm so sorry. Yeah. Lo siento mucho. ¿Quién fue? <laughs> I'm so sorry. And I see you tomorrow. Nos vemos mañana. I see you tomorrow. Please don't tomorrow, forget. Good night. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Bye -bye. Good night. Bye -bye. Good night. Bye -bye. See you tomorrow. Bye -bye. See you tomorrow. Bye bye.